Vegetable Police here. Suspect in question today, mixed martial arts. Why do we watch men beat the shit out of each other for entertainment in 2016? What the fuck? Instead of bursting out a cage like a raging animal, act your motherfucking age. I'm sick of it. So I'm a huge fan of the UFC. Should be no secret if you go to my most popular videos, they're all about the UFC. That's how I get views. I fucking sucker punch you in the view dick. But I'd be lying if I didn't say it was a guilty pleasure where I'm just like, this is wrong. I mean, we're watching two men get in a cage with a stadium full of fucking drunk guys and their popcorn and hot dogs wanting somebody to break a limb. They're cheering for it. Oh, I hope he breaks his dick. It's a brutal sport. I mean, the object of the game is to literally separate the soul from your opponent. You want him clinically dead for at least four seconds. That's the game. Then you're like, I won. And your opponent's like, I'll never be the same. So over the weekend, over in Bellator, the little sister of the UFC in its little pink ballerina dress, there was a fight between MVP Michael Venom Page and some guy, Cyborg. And MVP kneed him in the fucking head and cracked his skull. Literally cracked. He dented his fucking head. I didn't know that was even possible. I thought you had to be on a motorcycle going like 300 miles an hour and then dive head first into bricks. That's how you get that kind of injury. But this man was just fighting and the sound, you heard it crack. This guy's a warrior. He wants to fight again in three months. He said, I can fight in three months. Don't. Just lay, don't even wear a fucking headband for three months. You wanna fight? Stop, don't even put a hat on. Don't lay sideways, just relax. Get a hammock. So here's the moral dilemma. Is it okay to watch these guys injure each other for fun? The reality is these guys enjoy what they do. They enjoy the fame. They enjoy just going out there, knocking somebody out in front of millions of people. It's like their rush. It's like old time gladiators. And I get that. We can't say it's wrong when they're choosing to do it. So get that out of the way. They choose to do this. But would they choose to do this if there was better opportunities available on this planet? I mean, for some of these guys, they have no education. They don't know what they want to do for a living. All they know is fighting because they grew up having to defend themselves in these shitty areas. And for them, it's like, I could, I'm good at this. I could make a living doing this. And then they follow it professionally and they end up getting their skull cracked. But ideally on this planet, we would all be doing what we love for a living. And I find it hard to believe that punching people in the face is what most people want to do for a living. Even people in the UFC, I think if they had the choice, you could either go fight that guy in a cage right now, or not do that for the same money. I bet a lot of people would do the other thing. That's my guess. So I don't know, I'd like to hear from a mixed martial artist himself, the vegan champion, Brett Rawlings. What do you have to say, buddy? So I was trying to think of something funny to do for this whole part of the video, and then I thought, what's the point? I can't compete with Casey. He's got the whole vegan comedy scene wrapped up. So I'm just gonna give you my thoughts and opinions on this subject matter, and that's it. So please, just bear with me, guys. Okay, so is it right or wrong to enjoy watching two men just essentially want to kill each other? That's what they're trying to do in there. They're trying to cease one another's existence. I mean, really, I think it's fine. I think it's fine. Why do I think it's fine? Because it's not really got anything to do with me. They're choosing to engage in this practice and I'm just choosing to watch it. People could say, Oh, well, they wouldn't do it if you didn't want to watch it. I don't subscribe to that. I mean, these guys have got plenty of other career options, career paths they could go down 
but they like fighting. They like beating the hell out of people. A lot of them like having the hell beaten out of them. So who am I and who are you to, to tell them that that's right or wrong? Now I watched this fight the other day where this guy sustained a horrific injury by being kneecapped in the forehead. His skull got crushed and when I watched it, you know, I didn't like that. I don't like seeing that. But these things, they are pretty rare. Are they more common than other sports? Yeah, it's pretty common in comparison to other sports. But that doesn't mean these sorts of things don't happen in other sports. I mean, you've got NASCAR, Formula One, even soccer, people get killed and horrifically injured on a pretty regular basis, at least once a year. There'll be some sort of major incident like that. So, you know, the UFC is not the only sport where these things happen. That's it. That's all I've got to say on it. I say live and let be. When it comes to the people wanting to harm one another, let them harm one another. They're not harming anyone who's a innocent victim in all of this so let them get on with it and if you like the music in today's episode you can click on the link here and head on over to Bandcamp and purchase it because I'll tell you now if I find out that any of you haven't done that there's gonna be big trouble and I mean it you think we're doing this for fun think again go and buy his music last warning So that's it. I will still continue to watch the UFC as long as it's on because I enjoy it. I enjoy the stories between the fighters more than the actual fighting. I would rather watch two people I care about in a boring fight than two guys I don't even know put on an excellent fight. That's just me. I like the story behind it. So that's it. What are your thoughts? Should MMA... I can't even say that right. Should the UFC and MMA be legal? Should we be supporting this with our money? That is the question. Is it moral? You tell me. Thanks for watching. Thumb up the video if you liked it. Subscribe for more videos, and I'll see you in the next one. I'm sick of it. You eat meat thinking you're discreet, but you don't realize your burger had a heart. What do you do? Go vegan, motherfucker. Make a muffin. You couldn't even kill a rubber ducky, son. If you had to hunt.